Hi, beautiful. Today we have a Mondo makeover on Miss Sienna Gomez. She is so cute. She is so pretty. She's a TikTok sensation. She's so cool. And I'm ready to give her a new haircut, a new hair color, a new hairstyle, everything brand new. She's currently blonde. We're not doing any blonde today. Okay, you're welcome. So excited for the makeover. She's almost here. I'm gonna sit her down and we're gonna start the makeover. We'll do a little consultation. We'll talk about her hair a little bit, but I'm also gonna be asking her so many juicy questions about her life on TikTok, pulling up posts from her past, and just talking about it and knowing what's going on in her head behind these posts. Once I get my hands in her hair, I'll come up with some concoction in my head of what I wanna do and really figure it out. I wanna feel her vibe. I wanna feel who she is before I decide the hair color. So let's do it. Hi, Sienna. Hi. Welcome. <laughs> Hi. We are about to do your hair. I know, please fix me. Look at these locks. It's they are long. They are dead. It's time for a change. Yeah, we're gonna go really short, right? I don't think do so. Like I don't right know about here. that one. Like a little bob. Have you ever? Shave my head. Uh-uh. No, yeah, but I think when I was little. Ew, I would look so <laughs> gross. Don't even joke. We could just do a mullet if you want. Don't touch me with the mullet. <laughs> he just starts shaving. I'm like, uh. Um, no, but really, scared. we're gonna keep it long today. I like it. Right? Yeah, um, I love it long. Get rid of a little bit of length here. I want to surprise you a little bit with the color. We've talked a tiny bit about it, but she doesn't know exactly what she's gonna get yet. So I'm excited for the surprise. It's gonna be very, very, very different than what she has now. Um, and she wants that, right? I, I want drastic change. I want to yeah. like look different. I love a huge transformation. Yeah. So um, I'm gonna get started mixing up some color. We're gonna start applying some color and then we'll get into some juicy Q&A questions okay. for Miss Sienna. We're starting. We're gonna fill her hair. That way, this color sticks really well to her hair and it lasts for her. We don't want this washing on one wash. And you know, she is quite blonde right now, so we're gonna fill it up. You'll see, you might see a little color in my hands. Don't be alarmed. I'm nervy. Um, this will not be the final color. Okay. Just bear with me. You flew in last night. Yeah. What time did you get in? 4.33 yeah, a.m. That's a lot. I might fall asleep. All right, Sienna. So we have applied the filler that is going to help the color stick and we are going to start applying the actual real color over top of this and um, just keep working through it. You've got so much hair. It's a lot. I know. I look, she doesn't think she has a lot like, of hair. You know what's funny is I, I get my lashes done and they tell me I have a lot of lashes, but I've never been told <laughs> I have a lot of hair. So maybe I'm just a hairy person. No, I am. Wait, actually, like, like. Wait, yeah, no. <laughs> like looking at it. So, I mean, you have had a really fast little come up on TikTok, haven't you? Yeah. How long have you been doing this for? My first Sienna May Gomez account, I made when TikTok first started happening, it was like cringy. And I just had it kind of to watch videos and like do whatever. And then I think it had like 100K or 200K or something like that. So I created my second account, which was like a spam mm -hmm. for my like friends and stuff, which is now my like main account. Does this make sense? Can you, are you understanding no, what I'm, I'm saying? Kinda, it. Okay, okay. Fun. Sometimes it like doesn't make sense and I just like <laughs> babble. Maybe whatever. some people watch and might be like, what? Yeah, but it's okay. I get it. yeah. <laughs> Everyone's like, <laughs> no, but I created my Sienna May account, which is now my main account, and it had like no followers except for my like, three friends. And my first video I posted on that account ended up blowing up. What was supposed to be my spam or private ended up being my main <laughs> and growing up really, really fast. So my first video, I gained like 400K in like three days what? on TikTok. Yeah, it was just really, really fast. So that was in August, and now I'm almost at 15 million. It's insane. It's How insane has it been now. for you? Um, At first it was super overwhelming because it was really fast. So I was like, oh yeah. my gosh, I need to keep up. You know, it's been super fun and just, you know, it's not as like, deep as sometimes I like feel like it is. Mm -hmm. It's just entertaining people and keeping myself ha happy and healthy. Mm -hmm. And it's stressful cause, because I am young. I feel like I'm running out of time, <laughs> even though I'm literally like, have only been alive for 17 years. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I am running out of ideas and stuff and <laughs> I'm literally just starting. There's you can't run out, of idea run out of ideas already. <laughs> I know. It's like very worth it. I think the biggest thing with social media is like having fun with it. Definitely. Above all. And if you're not having fun with it, people could tell. It is is a real job and it does take a lot of work and like reinventing yourself constantly can get really tiring. I However, totally today we're doing me. a little reinvention, but. I know. <laughs> Please don't make me look bad, Brock, because I have to post some TikToks after this. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh my heck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Golly. <laughs> golly G, my <laughs> hair. <laughs> right now it looks like, um. remember when like Kool-Aid dye was a thing? Yeah. It kind of oh, yeah, looks like I a Kool-Aid Kool dye. I am using Kool-Aid. Oh, <laughs> are you? Yeah. 
like a thousand dollar cool yeah, in it. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, it's good. It's gonna look a lot more bright before we rinse it off. I'm not gonna question the process. You live I... in California. Yeah. And do you frequent the high pass? You'd say. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's like the main house I go to. I was actually reading your comments mm -hmm. on one of your first posts and people were really mad that you were invited to the Hype House, like in the beginning. In my very first videos, it would be like, I swear if she moves to LA and joins the content house, I'm gonna be really mad. I'm like, guys, I would never mean like, me and Hype House four months later. <laughs> It's not me, it's not me. <laughs> like guys, I wouldn't. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, I'm still I'm I'm still not in a content house. The house I go to the most is Hype House because obviously Jack's part of it. I get along with them super well. I don't know, they know what they're doing, you know what I mean? And mm -hmm. it's fun to be around people that are kinda like involved in the same thing. Yeah. For those of you who don't know about the Hype House, um, it's basically a bunch of TikTokers. <laughs> Brad, don't make it sound <laughs> <laughs> No, like, I'm like it's I'm a ton like, of TikTokers. It's basically a bunch of TikTokers who are so <laughs> You're like so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm like pissed. <laughs> like, Thanks for the invite, by the way. <laughs> and no, they make content together and they dance together. <laughs> I like dumb it down as much as possible. I'm like, I'm like, yeah. Sometimes they pull out uh, like. Uh, they do little like, dances. <laughs> they like to stand in front of windows and look hot. They in like, bathrooms. As well. uh, they really like bathrooms. I heard so. Bathrooms have the best lighting. Uh, apparently. <laughs> I think that was early last year, and that's when Jack and James uh, started times. going. You're saying that I'm not a good time? No, you're. A horrible time. <laughs> <laughs> Jack's your boyfriend, right? Mm -mm. No? Mm -mm. Do people know that? Yeah. We've Dude. never said we're dating. He's so my best friend. So you are, but you're like not. He's my best friend. This is how I say, a best friend is somebody that you love, somebody that you trust, somebody that you, you can make lots of fun with, lots of content. Mm. I've known him for five, six years. Oh, really? Yeah, so we've been friends for a really long time. Just cause but we- But not boyfriend and girlfriend for a really long time. <laughs> we've never said we're like, together, mm -hmm. dating, dating. It's one of those. It's just kind of like, you know. Implied? <laughs> Next question. Okay, so we are working on the front of your head now. Okay. It's turning a different color. I'm scared. So I picked out some TikTok posts for you to look at and you're gonna take a look and we're gonna talk about these TikToks, okay? Okay, so this is the first one. What is in this book? This is my journal. I have always kind of had a hard time like processing things, I guess. I'm just a very emotional person and I sometimes just need to like write things out. That's like the best way that I can like kind of deal with what I'm feeling and then I can look back on it. Like every day you deal with something new, uh -huh. you know, you feel a new thing. So I'll like look at like something from two days ago and be like, oh my, I totally forgot that like that was my problem two days ago. It's just a very therapeutic way to not go crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? I need that. <laughs> Okay, reminder that social media is fake shorts edition. When I was growing up, which is obviously still, but like the past few years, mm -hmm. I just feel like I couldn't really find anyone that I related to mm -hmm. with like my own body type. And I grew up as a competitive dancer where a lot of the girls were super beautiful and tall and skinny. There wasn't really like middle body representation. And so I really just think that it's important to like post these kinds of things and like show that like cellulite and like bruises are like completely normal. And yeah. like, I don't know, it's just not really something that people talk about, but I love that it's kind of being talked about more now. And for young girls to see that like that's totally normal is like very important. Okay, this is me dancing at playground. Oh my God, yes. I didn't know you were like a professional dancer. Yeah. Is that what you were doing before TikTok? I was on varsity dance team at my high school. Oh my God, that's I awesome. was dancing competitively at a studio for seven years, uh -huh. every day, three to nine. So I have a lot of dance background, but I stopped doing it so much when I started TikTok because mm -hmm. it was just, you know, it's a lot. Three to 10 every day was like low key tiring. And yeah. being just a kid, I just wanted to experience other things. You use so much sass. Like. <laughs> I still go to class. <laughs> I need to know this routine later. Okay, I'll just do like it. <laughs> this is a cinematic. So this song is by Beach Bunny. It's called Prom Queen and it's about eating disorders. Just kind of like the unrealistic beauty standard. And I feel like I resonated with a lot of the lyrics in here. The song's too good to just kind of like throw away. So mm -hmm. I wasn't just gonna be like, <laughs> or like, so I feel like that was like. Us today. <laughs> no, I know. But I was like, I need to actually do something like meaningful to this, something yeah. that people will remember. So I just created this like little cinematic. It's beautiful. This is probably my favorite video I've ever made. Oh, you and your boyfriend? Yes, me and my best friend. Very cute. We did a little picnic date and. Um, <laughs> With your friend. 
<laughs> Keyword date. Oh yeah, a little, I mean a little picnic. <laughs> this was at a photo shoot actually. A little grassy area. We like made some TikToks after and this is like one of them. It's like kind of couple goals, but it's fine. Yeah, best friend goals it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, me and my best friend do that too. Yeah. This was your first, my very first video. That went viral. It has 20 million views, I think. Does it really? Yeah, which is so many people. And that was your first like blow up video. At the end of the video, you can see a hand and it's like my brother's hand. I like had ate a ton of food before I filmed this and I was super bloated And then I like always wear my sweatpants low after I eat because I don't like to feel like constricted And then the wop was like a huge thing mm -hmm. So I just like made a video like anyone else would and then my brother was like, oh, you won't post that and I was like Yeah, I will watch me. <laughs> I wasn't going to at first because I was just like who would want to watch that? I realized that it actually had deeper meaning than mm. I figured. Okay, so the hair color has been applied It is officially processing it's gonna take about another like 25, 30 minutes to process and then we're gonna rinse it out. So I just shampooed her hair. It's looking so good, exactly how I want it. Makeup artist is gonna be here in a second. So we're gonna do that after this as well. Look at my hair. Are you freaking out? Look, like what? Can we go blonde? Come on. Yeah, let's just go blonde. <laughs> Brad, are you sure you want to do this? We are almost done with your hair. Um, we're gonna have makeup come in. We're gonna do your blow dry. Make we're gonna me not crusty. Do <laughs> we're gonna do everything up, and then <sighs> we'll show the finished result. Sienna, this beat is automatic super. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it, I get it. Like, you get it? Oh, it's the era. Oh, okay, that was cute. I liked it. I didn't get it at first, but now I got it. <laughs> it was, your hair is so pretty. And it's not just because I did it. Do you love it or no? I know I love it. Yeah. No, you know I love it. What? Hello? No, I <laughs> love it. She's been feeling herself for the past like 30 minutes to I'm an like, hour. I'm like, Brad's like, can we film? I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> already doing it. Um, it looks so good. She has this like violet red moment. It is so shiny. Your hair looks so much healthier. It looks so much healthier. We only did a little bit of a trim. We added some curtain bangs. Turn your head to the side for everybody. Ooh. Other side. It's you a look good change. Slightly older, like more mature, but I think it's still mm -hmm. so good. And when you have it like natural and wavy, yeah. it's gonna look really cool. I'm so happy you I love it. I need an outfit change. I need to go get dressed. She's gonna be doing a photo shoot too on her channel. Um, she has a whole video about her trip to New York City, getting her hair done, her makeup, wardrobe, photo shoot, everything. So go check out her channel. It is linked below. And that is all from Sienna. I Thank love you guys. Thank so you so much for being on my channel. You were amazing. Always. So much fun to hang out with. Um, she's actually just as sweet as you think she is Aww, in real life. So. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, keep looking at myself. It looks amazing. So we're gonna be like, she's self-obsessed. Yeah, like, yeah, she's so I obsessed. I am. Like, look at you. I know, I really love it. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you do write down below. Click the like button and the bell icon to be notified every time I post a new video. If you're not already following me everywhere else, make sure you do hear all my social media handles all around me. Go for it. Check out my Live Your Extra Life merch right here. It is so freaking cute. I wear it all the time. You can shop right down below or you can head to our website at xmodohair.com. If you'd like to check out any of the products I use in today's video on Sienna's hair, you can do so right down below. You can also head to our website xmodohair and xmodocolor.com to check out my hair care line and my color line. 
You can also find some hair inspiration on our Instagrams at xmonocolor and xmonohair. Everything is linked below for you. Make sure you text my number right here. Yes, it is really connected to my phone. Yes, I really do see your text messages. And yes, I'll be texting back a few of you guys if you text me right now. It'll also keep you notified every time I post a new video. Today's Instagram shout out goes to Alexis. It says, so I've been rocking a new style the past few months and I was wondering what color I should try next. Okay, I love your hair. It's really cute. I mean, I feel like this is just because of this video I filmed today, but also I feel like you would look really, really good with red hair. Like what I did today, it would look so fire on you. If you end up doing it, I would love to see a photo and good luck. That's all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.